Welcome to Manifested Publishers. Hello learners, my name is Stephen Kariungi and we continue with the factors affecting the rate of reaction and the fourth factor is catalyst. So we'll start by defining what is a catalyst and we can say that a catalyst is a chemical substance that alters the rate of reaction that alters the rate of reaction without being chemically affected without being chemically affected so we have some chemical substances that we use so that the uh, reaction uh, can happen or can occur at a faster rate so that we can get the products within a short time and we can say that we have different catalysts that are suitable for different reactions so different catalysts are suitable for different reactions and we are going to have an investigation in form of an experiment and this is an experiment to investigate the effect of manganese four oxide on the rate of decomposition on the rate of decomposition of hydrogen peroxide and the procedure for that investigation is to measure 50 cubic centimeters of hydrogen peroxide of a given concentration in a conical flask let's make these a hundred Then we leave it for some time and collect the gas produced as shown below. So the first uh, step in the procedure, we are measuring 100 cubic centimeters of hydrogen peroxide of a given concentration. And then we are transferring it into a conical flask. Then we leave the setup for some time and collect the gas produced as shown or in a gas uh, syringe. So we'll have a conical flask. that has hydrogen peroxide <clears throat> so that is the setup 
hydrogen peroxide does not uh, nothing is added we just put in a conical flask and then we collect the any gas that is being produced in a gas uh, syringe then we continue with the procedure and uh, see we repeat the above experiment but now adding two grams of manganese four oxide two grams of manganese four oxide into the hydrogen peroxide and we are saying that a point to note the volume and concentration of hydrogen peroxide should be the same or should remain the same so we'll have a diagram for that so we have hydrogen peroxide just like in the previous case we have a gas syringe to collect the gas 